Yeah, I'm breaking the cardinal rule. I'm wearing socks with my sandals, man. You know why? Because I left my sneakers in my truck. What's up guys? It's Friday! You know what that means? That means we sat at home all week without a single load. <laughs> yeah, it's Friday and we are just now in the truck going to work for the week. Can you believe it? Maybe you can. If you've been playing the spot market, you know that the spot market was absolutely brutal this week. Oh my gosh, guys, I'm such a doofus. I can't believe I forgot my freaking wallet. Menemy, Wisconsin. Did I say that right? Maybe. We're here getting loaded up at the Walmart DC. Uh, this is kind of an interesting load, guys. So we're picking up electronics for a company that is not Walmart. Uh, it's a construction company. We're picking up electronic devices of some sort or another for a construction project we are going to a job site yeah we essentially are flat batters except for we got the box behind us but we're going to a job site in loveland colorado i believe it's a walmart job site but i'm not 100 percent sure but we are going to a job site with this load of electronics which i don't know what they are what they do uh, i just know that it's about seventeen thousand pounds and it's electronics uh, but we're here, we're backed up to a door. Uh, I imagine they'll get to loading us here soon. And uh, yeah, we can figure out what to do next. <laughs> Originally I was intending to hit the road, uh, but now that I forgot my purse and I don't have my ID or any credit cards or anything on me. I mean, I have Apple Pay through my phone, uh, but that might possess a slight problem, so they're loading us already that's awesome i better figure this out quickly <laughs> you know how some days you got it other days not so much i've lost my stinking visitor pass they might not let me leave here guys they're like clip it to your shirt okay cool i clipped it to my shirt i don't know where it went i must have lost it I don't know where I lost it. I don't think it's in my truck. This is like, man. <sighs> okay, so that's awesome. Yeah, 
is not in my truck, guys, which means it must have fallen off when I left the check-in and was walking back to my truck. Oh, man. Yeah. Today is not my finest performance. <laughs> Gotta go to another location here uh, to pick up some conduit. Basically, we're going around the building. <laughs> Actually have a safety vest. Maybe let's bust it out. Just maybe. I had a hard hat, but I don't think I have it on me. I think the hard hat is in the garage. It used to be in fancy. Look, that would be safety. Well, there's our load. Well, that was not bad at all for my first job site experience. Not at all. Uh, let's hope that Walmart lets me leave uh, since I managed to lose their visitor badge. Uh, speaking of losing things, uh, Martin is going to bring my purse out um, that I managed to forget. So we're going to hang out here for about three hours, uh, maybe more, but it's going to take Martin about three hours to get here and uh, maybe we'll grab some dinner with him uh, before we hit the road. I, I probably could have got through the trip with just the photo that I have of my driver's license because uh, it's pretty rare that anyone even asks for it ever. And uh, I have the Apple Pay, but I know, I know, it's not how you do it, but this isn't the how you do it show. So this is how Alice does it. And sometimes, sometimes Alice is kind of a blonde. I forgot to tell you guys what we're hauling. We're hauling things. We're hauling things, yeah. No, I mean it is, but that's, I'm not just gonna leave you with that. Uh, we are hauling things that are being used for them to uh, basically take your jobs. They took your jobs. So that Walmart I was just at here uh, and Manisha, no, Menemy, Menemy. They're going robotic. They're installing robots in the Walmarts. And so the Walmart I am going to in Loveland is also taking your jobs because they're putting robots in that warehouse. Yeah, don't worry. They're going to take our jobs, too. <laughs> we got all these self-driving trucks coming. <laughs> I can't believe you drove three hours. I can't believe I drove three hours, either. 
Just to bring you some tomatoes and some damn cheese. <laughs> I got a piece over there. Me too. Let's go. Lot of gas in this car. Let's go pee together in this truck stop. You know cheaper gases here? I didn't notice. It was 284 back there. It's 298 here. I almost feel bad I didn't stop back there. What? We don't feel any good at that. People are going to think we're janky. <laughs> but we are. Thank you, universe. Brand new can of baking powder. That's the big one, too. electronic logging device. We are 7.3 miles southwest of Lakeville, Minnesota. We opted to stay at an incredibly blue rest area last night. The lighting was very ambient. We uh, put 80 gallons in the truck. Uh, that's going to get us to uh, Nebraska because although the fuel cost here for us is $294, and that is amazing, by the way. Love that. It's even better in Nebraska. So we're just putting a little bit in to get us down to Nebraska because in Nebraska it's $284. And with any luck, maybe it'll go down even more by the time we get there. Uh, as far as what we have planned for today, uh, obviously, fuel stop, which check that's done uh, next stop we're planning to do would be washing the truck and trailer I think we're going to stop in Council Bluffs to do that at the Blue Beacon uh, and then from there we are going to get into Nebraska and I do believe we will call it a night in Grand Island Nebraska at the Bosselman's uh, strictly just because in the morning then we can go eat eggs and toast and that makes me happy
right there. Right there's my exit. Guess who's not taking it because they're on the left side of the road instead of the right. I should have known better. have like 100 gallon tanks or something because I've been sitting here for seven minutes now and the dude was literally pumping when I pulled up and he's still pumping this place I do not recommend the fuel is really cheap at 284 a gallon but uh, first of all the lot is uh, dirt and kind of ridiculous to get over here to the fuel pumps and it is a cluster here today like each pump is at least two to four deep in line waiting to pump that I might actually get a good wash job here. It was a little funny though, because they're like, you want your engine washed? I'm like, no. And they're like, why not? I'm like, because it's hot. All right, so they do use acid. Uh, they're supposed to cover the tanks. They didn't. There's my freshly acid wash tank. Yep. I, I, yeah, that sucks. I brought polish with me, so guess what I'll be doing later? I'll probably be sleeping later, but then after that, I'll be polishing my tank. apparently in years now turn around it doesn't know where I am but I know where I am we're just getting on to 76 here heading towards Denver crazy paint job or test Volvo I'm gonna go with maybe a test Volvo that's probably what they're doing they're testing it all right, I gotta go potty. Oh, you too? All right, you can come with me. No parking? Make your own. No one needed to park in all those spots when people clear out anyway, right? TP for your thoughts? No? I don't know, when I pull out of here, that guy's gonna look real silly. Just saying. It is 82 degrees outside, but if you ask my truck, it's 87. Time to change my shoes. All right, you guys can't see this, but <laughs> this is the worst rest area ever. Cause like that dude literally is coming in and uh, he about took out my trailer. So I quickly pulled forward. I'm also fairly certain he might be potentially taking out the RV next to him. Uh, do not recommend this rest area.
gentlemen, it's time for us to get rid of this load. That's it for this load. Trailer swept out. We're on to our next one. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video today. If you did, I don't know, give us a like, subscribe, share it, whatever makes you feel good at night. And uh, we'll catch you on the reload. See you soon. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. You see the drip, yeah, I fit it up. Hop in my car in the giddy up. Secure the bag, yeah, I get the bus. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Pick it up. You see the drippy, I'm fitted up. Fit up. Hop in my car and a giddy up. Mm. Secure the back, yeah, I get the bus. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Ooh, I've been on the flex since flex zone.